doing some long overdue testing today. This is a foot pedal that is controlling the tilt gimbal. And I just am using the head tracker mounted to the foot pedal to do this. And yeah, just uh, trying it out sort of to see the viability of this as an alternative to head tracking for those who don't like the idea of head tracking. It's intended as a potential alternative to head tracking and that was what this testing was for to see if it was viable and uh, just briefly my conclusion is that uh, not really uh, I mean I think maybe if someone really hated the idea of head tracking for some reason uh, which I would I would I would really want that person to try head tracking before making that conclusion uh, but uh, yeah, if someone just really couldn't do it, this might be a viable means because uh, you want some type of control that doesn't interfere with your stick control. And, uh, you know, you can put it on a slider and maybe move it with your pinky. But I'd say this is only slightly better than, you know, moving a slider with your pinky, uh, which I my the first time I ever tried uh, flying with the tilt gimbal. I, uh, that's actually what I was doing. I just had it on my pinky uh, before even trying head tracking. Um, and you can, I mean, you can control the, the tilt gimbal that way. You just don't have very much resolution. And that was my problem with this was that um, I just was not able to really have that fine of control uh, for the tilt. I, I, I put about seven packs through it. Um, over the course of a couple days, I tried to give my mind some time to sort of... Uh, let that sort of learning sink in and uh and as far as mapping my mind to get this to to sort of make sense that that actually wasn't that hard um that it wasn't nearly as natural as head tracking it well like head tracking is is emulating if you were just in a, a full-scale helicopter uh, it it really yeah, it's, it's very natural. Uh, this isn't as natural, but with practice, I think you probably could remap it. But yeah, the problem is in sort of the dexterity of your foot. I think our feet have a lot of dexterity for pressure. Like if you think about like the rudder of, uh, of an airplane or a helicopter, uh, we, we obviously do have dexterity in our feet like race car drivers. But I think that's I think that's mainly for pressure, not necessarily position like this. Uh, I think... I think, uh, yeah, our just our, my at least, uh, experience was that my, my foot just didn't have that much dexterity. Uh, I tried it standing, um, I tried it sitting, um, and it just, yeah, I just didn't feel like I had that fine of control over it compared to, to the, there's a lot of, there's a lot of resolution in your neck. Uh, we have very fine control of our head movement. Uh, not so much for your, the tilt of your foot, uh. Anyway, that's my conclusions. Uh, if you really want to try this and you really hate the idea of head tracking, just try head tracking anyway and just get the head tracker. And the link to this $30, uh, $30 foot pedal uh, will be in the article. Get the foot pedal. Uh, any of the head tracker uh, options will have the plate you need to do this, which is just the flat plate. And just do what I did. Double side tape it to the side of it and give it a go. And uh, I think you'll come to similar conclusions that I have that head tracking just is better. When I switched back to head tracking, um, it was just like, oh, the feeling was, was great. Obviously, I have a lot of practice with that, but it was, 
he just instantly was just a way more natural feeling and also effortless like my my foot was actually starting to fatigue trying to like very carefully move this pedal now granted there is a little bit of drag and maybe that's a factor but i mean there's not that much drag so i don't know anyway those are the results of my testing uh, i would love to see someone else uh sort of put more time in this and maybe more like further fine tune the setup like try uh, to have sort of less drag in the system, see if that changes things, you know. I really would love to see, yeah, someone explore this more, but I think this is the end of my testing for this. Uh, and yeah, happy flying. One more thing, uh, which is that uh, I failed to mention that it might be very useful for a, an additional control. Uh, for example, uh, Street League, how they have that boost uh, boost button on your transmitter. Well, hitting that button is going to be kind of hard uh, if you're trying to maintain precise control of the sticks. This might be a great solution for that. Essentially, when you want that boost to push down on the pedal, uh, stuff like that. Uh, there's sort of a lot of applications uh, that could use a control like that that I won't get into. It's kind of implicit, but... Uh, but yeah, so foot, foot pedal might be a, a proper solution for stuff like that, where you just need an, an additional control that doesn't need to have a bunch of resolution to it. All right, that's it. Happy flying.